overall fan trotting. Tarport Ramey quickly has the lead on the outside. Mac Lobel out fast along the rail. Cotton Hanover gets away third. Midnight Sunrise fourth. Newcaster Hanover fifth. On the outside racing six as they swing around the turn of Spotlight Lobel and driving now to the front. Mac Lobel is going to cut it. He leads Tarport Ramey by two and a half lengths. Two world champions. One, two at this point. Third on the inside. Cotton Hanover. And now finding room along the rail. Spotlight Lobel ducks in fourth. They're at the quarter. Trotting fifth, Midnight Sunrise. Six past that mark under the backstretch. Newcaster, Hanover. Seven is Buckfinder. Eight after a break. Blinding speed, front panel, 27-1. And they're trotting fast as they race down the backstretch. And Mac Lobel not waiting for anyone. He's racing toward the half-mile mark. He leads Tarport Ramey by two and a half lengths. Third on the inside, Cotton, Hanover. Fourth along the rail, Spotlight, Lobel. Trotting five, Midnight Sunrise. Racing six, Newcaster, Hanover. Seven is Buckfinder. And far back, Blinding speed. Half 54 4. The fractions are right for a world mark, but he will face the wind as they turn for home. They're past the draw gate. Off quarters and 27 1, 27 3. They're now in the third quarter. And Mac Lobel, who already is the second fastest trotter the sport has ever known, second only to practice, leads by six lengths. Tarport Ramey second, third, Cotton Hanover four. As they race toward three quarters, the spotlight Lobel fifth at that mark is Buckfinder three quarters, 1 23 1. So a last quarter. A last quarter in 30 and 1 would tie this trotter as the fastest ever, and this could be it. Mac LaBelle in the lane, needing a last quarter only in 30 and 1 to tie, and he's strong in the stretch. He leads by 7. Mac LaBelle trots toward the wire. Mac LaBelle, who will attempt to be a triple crown winner, opening 12 lengths on the field, and Campbell and Mac LaBelle may have the world mark. They're at the timer in 52, 1 fifth. On B. Mac Lobel didn't just break the world record, he has lowered it by a second and a